What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another episode of Eluto Plays. Today, we're going to be playing Darksiders 3. Darksiders 3 is a game that's currently available on Stadia. For the one-month sub, you get, like, a handful of games for free. This is one of them. And uh, we're just going to start getting straight into it. Um, I got it on Reckoning mode. This is, like, the hardest difficulty. And I've not made it past this first level. You can probably see why already right off the bat. I'm uh, still getting used to the game, getting adjusted to the animations and the timing and all that. So far I know uh, how to sprint, do the basic combos, and uh, I think if I kill these guys I collect enough souls that it allows me to do like a transform ability or something. This game has a dodge mechanic where you can iframe. I'm not very good at it yet. Let me get some frame rates here. But yeah, this is what it is. This is a. Uh, I just started this game. We're going to be getting used to the controls and adjusted. And we're going to figure out the mechanics. We're going to figure out how to beat this shit on reckoning mode. It's going to take some time. You can uh, actually target with L2, so maybe I'll use that a bit more. As you do die, you, you are collecting souls and saving them up. Like, I don't have it set to where if I die once, it's over. I actually have it set up. How you doing, sir? What are you doing? I figured out how I could play music and stream without the stream hearing the music. Yeah, I like to listen to music while I play, so I imagine I'll be able to get into it a lot more. The camera? What about it? What about it? It looks like nothing. Oh, I disabled the preview whenever I'm not... Uh, if I don't need it, I disable the preview because I get more FPS. If I show the preview, then it takes all my FPS in the game. So it's like, it takes a load off of my graphics card. He talking about, he talking about this guys. I had this up over there on the side and I was telling him he likes to stream too. You can right click this area here and uncheck enable preview. And that gives you some more frames. So yeah, this game Darksiders 3 is actually really hard. Um, I haven't got past the first boss yet. I fought it multiple times already. But it is teaching me the mechanics. Like, uh, I'm definitely learning the mechanics. I usually like to get to the first boss without getting hit. But I've already taken a hit. So, I'm gonna use my Nephilim's Respite. That'll heal me. And I only have one more heal. So I got one heal to beat this boss on. I'm gonna have my headphones on. Here we go. This boss is called Envy. Oh, can't jump that. Oh, okay. Dodge, counter. Dodge sideways. That wasn't a counter. Dodge. Ow. Forget we can target. We can hold L2 and ta ta target. Let's heal. Jump. Oh, we got a heal off, but it still took damage. Oh. I try to jump that normally I can't. I gotta actually dodge. Dodge. Counter. He didn't like that. I mean, ideally we don't get hit at all. And if it's possible to not get hit at all, then it shouldn't matter if we're low on hit points. Just because I deserve what's mine. Uh, get some of those apples. Huh. We got two souls here. Ah! Um. You bitch. Okay. Try again. Okay. 
L2 to focus Fury on a single enemy. Use R to cycle through enemies. The right joystick to cycle through enemies. Let's go, let's go. I think you still fight these guys. I don't know if it helps. Get him, got him good. There's some benefit to killing these guys. I don't know it yet. It has something to do with these souls. And there are different combos you can do. Like if you do like an XX hold and then X hold then XX. Like it's all it works like that. I just spam X. I figure I'll, I'll probably figure these combos out eventually. I gotta get good at the basic mechanics though. It doesn't take anything to get good at the basic mechanics. Bam bam bam. There's probably like secret hidden goodies too. Bitch. Fuck. Oh, damn. <laughs> Let's run that back. Can't jump dodge. Oh, motherfucker. Oh, mother damn. <clears throat> okay, okay, okay. Press R1 to time your dodge. Press R1 to dodge. Time your dodge to avoid damage. So while we're losing and failing up here, we got on the top left a uh, bar that's been charging. And it's like, I guess like a, a wreck fest mode. You can go kind of go into a berserk. So I'll keep killing these guys and uh, farming that up. Maybe we can pop it on the boss and get the boss down quick. So I think those apparitions appear when you've died and it's like a chance for you to get your souls back or something.
Can y'all both get in front of me, please? Oh, you motherfucker. Okay. Heal. That would've been nice to dodge. I'm gonna use my lock on. Oh, that was kind of cool. Yeah, you definitely get different combos depending on how you press or don't press. Like, if you hold your pauses and do double taps or randomly hold as you're attacking. I think you can accidentally do quite a bit of combos. Almost fell. We have 300 souls. Oh, he hit me with that shit. Oh, he hit me with that shit. Oh, he hit me with that shit. Heal up. Oh, can't go in attacking and then try to dodge in the middle of a swing. Did I get him? I don't know if I got him with that. Oh, oh. <coughs> touche, touche. That song was actually kind of fire. Okay. So I finally uh, took the time to figure out how to split my audio. I know about voice meter and VB audio cables and all that shit. I just never took the time to split the, the different audio sources. I feel it's a lot easier to get into gameplay if I got some tracks playing in the background. So, uh... I'm about to be probably going more hard than normal lately or in the coming in the coming days yeah you wish buddy let's go Try to attack and dodge at the same time. I'm still learning the timing on the frames. I'm getting there. I've not been one for the uh, Souls series or like games like Elden Ring and all that. I've never really played those. So even this Darksiders 3 is... It's like the last game I played like this would have to be prototype i think on playstation 3 that game prototype and then i don't know if there's another game that i played since then that's been like kind of this style i don't recall like nothing comes to mind maybe it was just over so quickly I don't know if you'd consider a game like Cyberpunk like this. I wouldn't think so. This is too hack and slash to be considered like a Cyberpunk. Honestly, I thought this was gonna be like an isometric game. I, I think I was thinking Torchlight. I've never played Torchlight either though. The closest I've played to that 
Uh, Train comes to mind, but I don't know if they're the same type of game. Let's go ham. I don't know if I need to dodge when I'm in this form. I think I just go off on him. Didn't let me out of that animation in time. This is new. Okay, we went down a few levels. I think I have to figure out how to get up there. Ah! Uh, what, what, uh, this? Go. He's panicking. Let's not get greedy. Oh, it's been a back out and heal. I should have just went in. Day mm. 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 yeah, boy, day yeah, boy. You okay? I heard him coming. <clears throat> Let's get the calming ocean sounds off. Let's go for some... Something... Very scary people? What is that? I don't know about that. Nectar. Let's go for nectar. I don't know if it's smart to get multiple. I'm gonna see if I can try to get multiple. Oh, they went down kind of quick. Yeah, those are the souls that I dropped. Let's get him.
Y'all that bullshit, I see you over there. Cause the song's loading. Lot of them first. Press and hold X to perform a chain cycle as a sweeping attack. Yeah, okay. Ow. Ow. I'm gonna fucking die. <laughs> I should probably pick up these souls. Your souls are mine. That's 320 souls. Oh, this is another side effect of music. Is If I'm going to be listening to music, I'm probably not going to be talking along. I'll get used to listening to music and I'll start talking eventually, but I'm probably going to be listening to the music more. <laughs> Come on, man. You want some of these apples?
It's so fast to follow up there after he gets low on health. I gotta be prepared for that. He does a swipe and a stab real quick sometimes. Motherfuck. Why are they like harder than the boss sometimes? I don't have any heals. It's gonna be rough. That was the one. He does it even before 50%. It's good to keep in mind. Let's go.
Fuck! I saw my health low and I panicked. Oh, we going in with Havoc. I think I use it after phase two though. I don't I don't think I use it right away. Or do I just open with it? I should just open with it so I can build it back up, huh? Uh L1 R2, that's what it was. Can I not target him? Oh, I'm getting healed off of this. Yes! I think I use it phase two. I think that's what I should have did. Because I only ate like a quarter of his health. Grab the fucking okay. Oh, let's say what the hell. Hit him with it. Heal. <laughs> Pr 
pretty. Come and get it. Feels good to see that motherfucker die. A mistress, not to be a father, but weren't you supposed to catch envy? He's twitching. I did. Feels good. This talisman. It's a vessel. Envy used it to hold energies from the rest of the seven. It will make a fitting prison for the others once their physical forms have been broken. Oh uh, yeah. If I may, there is a well a sort of hum emanating from the talisman. That glow will indicate when one of the seven is nearby. I know. So wise. You are all that the council promised, mistress. I'm beginning to enjoy the sound of your voice, Watcher. Talisman of Sin. The Talisman of Sin will guide you to the deadly sins. It's displayed at the top of the screen and it directs you towards the nearest sin. The skull indicates the nearest sin and the dot indicates other sins that are currently accessible. Lurcher crystals. These crystallized collections of spirits can be shattered in your inventory to acquire the souls that are trapped within them. Ah. And with that, folks, we're going to wrap up today's episode of Elude Star Wars Plays Darksiders 3. I hope you guys enjoyed that as much as I did. Uh, it was a bit of a pain. It was a bit of a pain, but we got through it. And uh, maybe next time we'll see where that hole goes. Peace.